This is the beautiful BMW X3, three litre, but they call it the M40D. And this is a tremendous car, 2019-19 model, with only 16,000 miles on, one owner from new, and full BMW service history. This car's got loads of extras, but first of all, it would have been the M40D. It's got lots of power, I mean, they're a twin turbo, diesel, tremendous amount of power. It sounds great as well, and good running cost. Now this one's got loads of extras like I said, so first of all, you'll notice straight away from there, it's got the adaptive BMW LED headlights, so that's full headlights in LED, and you have the new glass piece, what you call the daytime running lights. You've got all the serial finish on this, so that's the serial finish on the grills, the inserts, the door mirrors, and all the way around the car, which I'll show you as well. Being the M40D, you've got the different style bumpers, you've got front parking sensors, rear parking sensors, and then this one's got the very attractive 21 inch upgraded alloy wheels done in high gloss black. Every single alloy wheel is absolutely immaculate with no scuffs or scratches. And you can see the M Sport braking system with the blue calipers just behind there. The car has got parallel parking as well, what you call park assist. So the car does park itself. And it is a metallic black satire as well. So it has got a nice little shimmer in it, depending on which light you're in. As I mentioned before, again, these mirror covers in the Sirium Grey is only available in the M40Ds. You, you, you can't get that in the 30Ds or 20Ds. So again, straight away, it identifies what it is. With a full sort of stance on the vehicle with all the black styling pack, which is the window surrounds, sun protection glass, the roof rails, door handles, even the arch kit, everything is color coded. So it does look tremendously well. But then look at this. Isn't the, this the most inviting interior? This is the new G model car. So it has a completely new interior dashboard, cabin, ambient lighting pack, and then look at this perforated seat, it's beautiful. Very sporty, yet comfortable. It is amazing, electric seats. This one's also got Harman Kardon sound system, the most up-to-date digital infotainment system, heated seats, dual zone climate control, and you can see the ambient lighting carrying on, and it is X-Drive. So X-Drive is four-wheel drive, not constant. It'll drive in two-wheel drive for most of the time, but as it loses power, or traction, sorry, even, it'll kick in and it'll get you going again. The perforated seat continues in the back. You've then got the ambient lighting again, the extra speakers of the Harman Kardon. And if you look up, this car's got the tilt and sliding panoramic roof. So again, spec-wise, it's got everything. Fully fitted velour mats. The new style LED lights on the rear, which again, are wide lensed. So for, the reason they do it this way, it makes the car look wider than what it actually is from the rear, which is quite clever on its own. Automatic tailgate, reversing camera, and with it being the X3, you've got a very nice generous boot. You've got height, you've got width. This is a very big load area. Seats go down 20, uh, 40, 40, 20, and then you have the black tailpipe coverings. And because of the M40, Day, you can see the way the design, a bit of a lip on it. So again, it looks tremendously well. The rear diffuser is completely different. But what a good car. Underneath you have a bit more space and cubby hole, locking wheel nut, automatic tailgate. And the car is genuinely in a very good condition. That's interior and exterior. As mentioned earlier, all the wheels are in perfect condition. Not going to hide there. But look at it. It doesn't look like there's been anyone sat in the back. The backs of the seat. Just what a nice, it's a mid-size 4 by 4 I call this. But that being said, the G Model X3 isn't much smaller than like a 2005 X5. So they have, they have grown in size. If you look at the, the original X3 to the most recent one, this one here, it is bigger. But it's a nice height, like to get into it, I'm not having to climb up or jump up. I can step into it, which is nice. Electric folding mirrors, the memory seats, drivers there, and then look at this. This is all changed completely. You've got the new steering wheel with a leather, leather steering there. This is all fine Nappa leather, so it feels nice and soft, but chunky. BMWs have always had a very nice chunky steering wheel, so it feels very sporty straight away. Push button start, and then this one's got heads up display as well. So if you look there, the heads up display is there. Navigation, Bluetooth, how fast you're going. All the full digital live cockpit there, that's all changed as well, which is, I mean, that's, such an up-to-date system there. When you put it in sport, it changes color, comfort, eco. So you've got blue, red, white. You can literally choose what you want. This is touchscreen. So again, if you want to use this, if it's navigation, radio, it doesn't get any easier. You can just literally zoom in, zoom out. It's perfect. You've got the twin cup holders there. And you've also got the wireless charging pad as well with the USB right next to it. 
eight speed automatic gearbox with a paddle shift there as well and as i mentioned before with a reversing camera with the guidelines you can see exactly where you are remember you have tilt and sliding panoramic roof if you don't want to use it or it's not a nice sunny day you can close it completely and the blind shuts for you automatically electronically center armrest again with more usbs and a bit of a cubby hole but you know what what a tremendous car it's a cracking car value for money life pricing today is 39978 that's a massive saving against a new one especially when the car's got one owner from new full service history in a beautiful condition but it's a spec now before we price this car we looked at what else was available and there's two dozens probably a bit more um of the 30 days and not as many 40 days because they are quite rare but when you are looking at a 40 day the only thing i can say to you if i may is please if you're comparing one and you see one at £1,500 less on the pricing. That isn't because I'm overcharging you. It's more than likely because my car's got a heads up display, the panoramic tilt and sliding roof. A big one which I keep talking about is wheels. Wheels make or break a car. Please don't call me or don't try to compare us to one with 19 inch wheels or 20 inch wheels because it's not the same and they're genuine wheels from the factory. Stunning car, stunning combination, cracking, cracking condition. And that speaks a lot for itself as well. Awesome car, great sound, great power, just come in, isn't going to last for too long. My name's Joe, thanks for watching, bye bye now.